Good morning. It is approximately, and I say that because I don't know where my phone is, 8.30 in the morning. I am in Costa Rica. <laughs> so exciting. We got here yesterday at like 6 in the morning, so we had the longest day ever. I felt like we had been here for days by the time we were eating dinner last night because I don't wake up at 6 in the morning, that's for sure. And we still did so much yesterday, even though we were all running off of like two hours of sleep. It was like a two-hour drive from the airport to where we're staying. I just haven't been in the sun in so long, and the UV rays here get up to like 14. I don't know if you can tell on the camera, but I am sunburned. But yesterday was the first time I was in the sun in actually like a year. I'm so serious. I got ill last week. I had a cold. And like I feel good. Like my, my body feels good. Like I feel good. But I still have a cough. You know, those things that linger forever. I don't have COVID, so everyone needs to relax. Okay? Anyway, we went to the beach. It was a black sand beach and the sand was so hot. I've never experienced anything like that in my life, like actually getting third degree burns. It was so, so beautiful. We were drinking pina coladas that we had been craving for many, many moons now. Me and Madison always talk about having pina coladas on the beach and that we've been needing a tropical vacation. And here we are. It's all very, very exciting. My skin's feeling a little raw today. Miss Sunburn. I also just am so pale and the dark hair doesn't help. I dyed my hair like black right before I left for this trip. We are going horseback riding. If you remember my Italy trip, we went horseback riding through the vineyards and it was one of my favorite things we did on the entire trip. So I'm really excited about this. We're going to do it through the freaking jungle. And then we're riding ATVs, which I'm also very excited about. Madison says she has some PTSD about an ATV accident. So I don't know if she's going to be joining. If that's how I go, that's how I go. <laughs> the rest of this vlog is just a, like an obituary. Stop. The rest of the day I, Really have no idea. I don't. I'm just going with the flow, you know? This is the perfect horseback riding skirt because it's like, oh, oh, my girl. And then I'm like, okay, I also put this little scarf in my hair because I know my bangs are going to fly out like crazy. Very good. Very, oh, yeah. Look at this bag of Takis. Mm. I got this watermelon and aloe drink. It's really, really delicious and refreshing. Tastes like a Jolly Rancher. It does. It has this trying really hard to not have a heat stroke. No, <laughs> I'm gonna have a bitch fit. <laughs> yeah, you better get out of here. We got like six water bottles because we are now a little traumatized from not having water last night. Agua de coco, and there's little chunkies of coconut in there. It's actually really yummy. And Maddie got the exact same thing. And then I got two giant bottles of water. And I'm gonna have a taco. And then have a taco. The thing is, they aren't crazy red because nobody but America mm. has the red dye. Right, and shit. why it probably do we need the same. it? And we don't. Mm -hmm. They're poisoning us. And they probably won't give me a raging I like headache. these better. They're kind of like the Trader Joe's ones. Wow. They taste like the Trader Joe's ones, which is what I like, but wow. wow. They're not as spicy as you think. Yeah. Cynthia Parker changed the theme to Bob Marley One Love. In our, in our chat. We're on like a three hour long ATV ride right now. I'm really stoked about that. I'm gonna be so sunburnt by the time we're done with this trip. I haven't driven yet. I made Cynthia drive because I was scared, but I think I wanna drive now. I don't know how much I can show you of us actually riding them because it's scary and I don't want to crash and fall. Just know we're doing it. We really be doing it. So let's ride. Bitches know they can't catch me. We are walking to a waterfall now, thank God, because it's so hot. I just sweat all over the seat of the ATV. I did drive this time, and we were going downhill the whole time, and it was very scary. But I need to be dunked in a body of water because I am disgusting and so dirty right now. How are you feeling, babe? I feel the exact same fucking way. <laughs> I think we all do. What, the camera? I can't see. I got dust in my contacts, I got dirt in my contacts. 
No. We rode the horses for a while and then the ATVs were for like four hours. But it was so, so much fun. Also, horse fast, ATV fast. I wanna go fast, I wanna ride horses, I wanna ride ATVs. I understand now why people ride motorcycles, actually. Even though they scare me to death. Uh, also, that'd be so hot. We were so dirty to the point. I wish I could show you my shorts. I probably have a photo somewhere. I was wearing Cece's white little like Brandy Melville boxer shorts. Stark white. Literally brown. Completely brown the entire thing because they were wet and then the dirt from coming back, it was insane. They were very dirty. We were all very dirty. There was dirt in my nose and my throat and my lungs. I'm... <laughs> Anywho though, we took a very, very incredible shower and we were chanting and <laughs> saying thank you to the universe. I'm so happy that I'm not so pale. God, this dark hair really also just made me extra, extra self-conscious about how pale my skin was. I'm wondering if I should blow dry my hair or if I should just let it dry naturally, but I didn't love the way it looked last night. Good morning, my friends. This bikini is killing me right now because my armpits are sunburnt. It's all our nights have been very, very mellow. We have such jam-packed days that we're so exhausted when we get back here. We literally came back here, ate dinner, and basically went to sleep. We watched Aquamarine, I watched it for probably 10 minutes before I fell asleep. Today we're going to be on a boat. I love boats. I've said this before. I'm so excited. I am worried because I'm looking a little bit Mr. Krabs-esque. But you know what? I'm wearing sunscreen. Cross my fingers. Mm. I never drink rum unless I'm somewhere <laughs> like um, beachy. We're gonna take some rum shots. I don't drink rum, rum at all. The beautiful people. We've been driving them up for 45-ish minutes. We're going to go on a little island tour, a little excursion, but we don't really want to be on a boat for two hours driving because we want to be able to get in the water. I loved the ocean and then I drowned and then I hated it and now I love it again. That was good. That was, that was good. That was good. <laughs> Hello girls, mama's a little burnt. Mama's pretty crisp. Mama's feeling a little torched. <laughs> <laughs> mommy's a little crippy. It's almost 7.30. We are about to have dinner. We literally just got back from the boat. We went on a little excursion just because me and Madison and Cece wanted a sweet treat so desperately because we haven't had one three days and that's just like so out of character for us. And then it turned into like, oh, well, we should just get more alcohol for tonight so that we can have a little party. And then we also have one more night. So like might as well just stock up for now. But then they're like, oh, well, we'll probably get more tomorrow. And I was like, look, I don't know, guys. You're buying it. And then we lost Jasmine. I almost picked up a cat off the roof because one of the guys here is 6'9". He just hoisted me up and I was on the roof. Having a crazy, crazy, crazy time. You got on the roof? It's our second to last night, so we feel like we need to rally, we need to party, which means that we cannot shower yet, we cannot do our skincare, we just need to keep going while we have the energy left in us. Tomorrow is going to be, I think, semi-chill. I think we're going surfing, so I think physically we might be a little unwell. <laughs> no, we're going to get scorched surfing, even more than a boat. You do, like, on the camera, look like a tomato. Pie. I know. Do I not in person? I feel like I do. Not as bad, maybe. We're gonna go eat dinner. We're gonna make some pina coladas. Also, very exciting news. Don't know if it's gonna last, so maybe I shouldn't tell you, but I haven't vaped in over a week. If you know me, you know I've been on that journey for quite some time now. So let's hope this one sticks. Woo! She's doing really good. She's doing super good, only had one cigarette. <laughs> Today is the worst one. It feels really, really horrible. And we're also surfing today. So I don't know <laughs> what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna come back like with my skin actually peeling off. Like not just like a sunburn peel, like the entire layer of my skin just slopping off. This situation is the worst. It's hard to even have a bikini on right now because it's so painful. But good morning. All we have on the agenda is to go surfing, which I'm really excited about. And then I don't think we have anything else planned. We haven't really explored the property where we're staying yet, so I wanna go and see what's around. Apparently there's like a really pretty bridge and a waterfall. I don't think we have to leave for another two-ish hours. There's heat just like exuding off my body right now.
Hey, Jaden's vlog. We just finished surfing. Jaden's a natural. We've decided that we're obsessed and we're gonna become surfer girls now and we're gonna take lessons in Malibu. And here she is, a little surfer girl. sunburnt today. You know when people are like, I'll burn but it'll turn into a tan. I think it's nine o'clock. We have to leave for our flight around 11.30. So I'm gonna go outside and tan for like an hour. Taking the rest of the sun that I can even though I still uh, probably shouldn't. My body hurts. My body hurts. And Madison and Cece already packed their suitcases but I just put my stuff in a pile on the floor because I didn't want to fold anything last night. I'm not ever really in the mood to fold. That's why I couldn't have ever worked in retail. Also our flight is like 10 hours and I'm crossing my fingers and hoping that I brought my SD card plug-in for my computer so that I can edit my video but also I lost my AirPod case, so my AirPods are dead. Either way, it's like I should try and figure out how I can make use of that time. I love the Stony Hollow triplets. They are so funny. Ah. And I'm so, so excited to go home. I cannot wait to see Theo. I am having separation anxiety. I slept almost the entire flight from Guatemala to here. There was nobody in my row besides Cece. I just laid completely flat and I slept like a baby. We're gonna go home and I'm gonna go right to bed again because I'm still exhausted. But I love you so much. I'll see you in the next video. Mwah.